Okay, hey everybody, how you doing? It's Lawrence and Ariel here. Just want to let you know that uh, we're just at Waterton Park and we pulled in and actually we just got a beautiful park here now, downtown, man. It's just absolutely gorgeous. So, so many people. And we've had uh, a few people come by and just uh, inquiring about the van and the awning and everything and just uh, what we've done to the back. So, just organized a few things. So, I'm just going to show you a little bit more of an in-depth now that we've organized and gone on one trip. So, we just got back from BC last week. But. So, this is the back of the van now, which is pretty organized. It's actually did pretty good. So, everything worked out here great according to what we did solar works fantastic the way we ran it through the bottom here worked out really good so with the solar down it works perfect one thing i did do is i added a little latch lock so i can lock it in place now and just uh just getting things a little bit more detailed as we go but down below we're great so we got lots lots of storage room now we ended up putting just different things in different areas just to keep it organized so we put our pots and pans and white's got a little rice cooker down here now and we got our <laughs> utensils and so it's it actually works perfect and i still got my little five gallon tank which works perfect and that's our foldable washing basin which is awesome and i got some windex for cleaning the window but the up top worked this worked really well so this little table when we do it, we've cooked on the rain a few times and it works perfect. It stays clean. So yeah, I wouldn't change anything on this now. It actually works really good. Up top here, the shelves work great. We just use the, my morning coffee and I keep our lighters in there now and anything for fire, which is which is perfect up here for us. So it makes it easy. And then, uh, yeah, our bowls, cutlery, everything worked perfect in here. Perfect size for us. This worked out really, really good. Strong, nothing's falling apart on us. Pots and pans, we actually bought a new one. In addition, so I got two normal, and then we got this one that we bought, which is really nice. I just put the little paper plates in between for now, it just stops it from banging around when you drive, but it keeps it great. And then underneath, this actually turned out really good. So the cooler and the little bags for our fruit and that. Uh, one thing we did find with the fruit, it's actually, um, when it's really, really hot, it's better to keep them inside of a cooler. Yeah. And then they just stay longer for us, but... If it's colder out and we're camping in, you know, September, late August, um, probably keep everything out, out. It still stays cool. But, yeah, the water turned out perfect. This thing, we lasted a whole, uh, I don't know, almost nine days. Yeah. And then we had to fill it, and that was it. But Because we don't use much. Coffees and just cleaning here and there. But for showers, we'll just grab water from, if we're at a park, just from the water that they supply you or we'll just grab it from a creek and heat it up. So it worked great for showers. But this little thing, it's just perfect, perfect. What I did install though is a bug net. Uh, I had one guy say, hey, how do you keep the bugs out? So what we did is I did install a bug net. You can't even really see it. It's actually um, Velcro, which is has a sticky side to it. So I laid that all out on the inside and then put it all together. I had to measure everything off. But then once I stuck it in, and it's permanent, but I can also peel it off if I need to. But um, it, it's really nice. So it keeps the bugs out. We can have this back open. Bugs can't get in. Uh, so if we're cooking or just going into the back, then it doesn't interrupt our sleeping area and keeps everything nice and clean for us, So, which is awesome. So, yeah, beyond that, everything else worked pretty good so far. It's been great. So updates, eh, nothing really back here right now. Uh, we are going to look at probably looking at a better battery pack. Yeah. We've got the Energizer 500 amps. And we found in our trip to BC that um, it's a great little unit. But as far as the power, if there's no sun for the day or if you're not driving, uh, it won't last the whole the whole day for us. So that's something that we'll either upgrade to a Jackery 1000 or a Jackery 1500. And then, uh, then we'll have two. Uh, or who knows, I might go to batteries later on. I'm not sure yet. But I just got to play with things because we're looking at an air conditioner too, a little tiny cooling unit. So that'll go back here. But anyways, for now, this is awesome. Our awning, this thing, I tell you, this is the perfect addition for us because this thing works so good and it's so easy for us. How much is this now, honey? It goes uh, close to 350 bucks now on Amazon. So, but it's still worth it. It's still so worth it. Our inside. Come inside. Yeah, come on inside. This thing is still working so great. We have lots of room. Um, what we do is we store our clothes. There's two of these. So this is mine. And they're so nice because they're just foldable. They go break down to everything, but they have so much room. 
and they're just nylon and they just slide in and out and they're so light but underneath we've got a bag for our dirty clothes and I actually keep the barbecue underneath here we've got this little backpack that's awesome this is from uh, Mountain Warehouse yeah this thing's awesome so we actually got our bear spray we got our little horn so when we actually go out for walks that we bring this this is our little life-saving thing I got a really good knife in here uh, that I put on and carry and it's just it's a sweet little unit so this is just for my own protection but if you ever need it I have it which is good because you never know but that little case is just perfect for us and we take that like I said any trip that we go to we'll just throw some water in it and then we'll go for a walk trail walk and then we we take that with us so then we have a room it just slides in okay just absolutely perfect so they actually fit in fit out very simple and yeah so these are just they work perfect hot 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 days it does keep a little bit of the heat out and actually because they're not velcro or anything we just made them a little oversized and they just slide in and push in they're great the smaller ones they're they're good too it just they give us lots of privacy which is awesome our little lights in here these little things worth it they're just they give you the added lights you need at nighttime and it's great in here for us it's just perfect lots of room comfortable like i said the bug netting we can keep that door in the back open if we're in here during the day and what i did do for daytime right now and for nighttime setup they actually put the the battery pack at the front of where the is it and i just uh what i do is it's perfect because i plug in our battery plug in our little ipad for watching movies this little thing is perfect so it's just our little flips down i just put it up top and that this thing's been just perfect for us it just sits in we watch our movies at night give us our privacy um one thing i did add to the curtains in the front is yeah. i added this was a double i had a single rod in here at one time but what i did is i put an l bracket plus a rod so the l bracket actually holds the frame for uh, this pad that holds the iPad and then the curtains on a separate pole underneath it so it just gives us that much more durability and strength to this but what I did do is I added some velcro onto the curtains that just close the gaps and it makes it so easy same on the middle I just put an easy the velcro it sticks on I tell you it's so easy it's so fast but uh, yeah we've, we've got tons of room in here Actually, we have no complaints for room. It actually worked out yeah. great, eh? Like, no issues whatsoever. Yeah. And, yeah, beyond that, this little fan thing works fantastic. Uh, enough to exhaust the fan out, but what I want to do is I want to reverse it and actually have it start blowing down. So, i got to do a little bit of reading, but just by looking at this, I can reverse the tongs and probably reverse the motor. So, I'm going to do some playing, take it apart, and actually see if it works just by reversing the plugs. The motor's just a little electric, so it should be able to go the other way too as well. We'll see. But uh, if that works, that'll be awesome because I want the I want actually air to blow down. The fans work great for circulating in here. And this, with it sucking out, I mean, it does circulate, which works okay. But uh, I'd rather have the air blowing in. I don't know. I'll see. But maybe winter camping would be better to have the heat go out. I don't know. We'll keep the heat in. But we'll figure it out. But yeah, so far, so good. No changes in here, that's for sure. Um, just battery power. And that's the only thing we got to think about. Upgrading that and getting... Yeah, a sleeping bag. Air and condition. Yeah, this thing is like <laughs> incredible. We actually ended up buying a really good sleeping bag, uh, which is rated for minus 30 weather. So we're toasty, warm. And I had like uh, three, three comforters underneath at one time. I got rid of those. Yeah, it was just too warm. Too warm, too bulky. No, it actually gives me... Lots of headroom, even me. I can sit up now, so it's kind of nice. But yeah, it just gives us our privacy in here. So it actually works out really good. Buck screen worked fantastic. Beyond that, we're sailing. We're out and exploring and having some fun. So I want to thank you guys. And yeah, we're just going to... We're we're doing good. We're having fun. Let's get the lights off.
touch yeah. everybody just uh, for watching and just for your support it's it's awesome so we just thank you like subscribe and continue watching and we've got a lot of good videos coming up on our bc trip so that was an amazing trip for us so just thank you so much and take care and we're going to go explore waterton right now and go for a nice little walk so thank you so much see you later see cheers you later.